Hey everyone, this is John the Watch Concierge and today I'm going to be doing a review of this Pagani Design PD1778 which is an homage to the Calatrava Patek Philippe Calatrava 6007G-010 in white gold and of course this one is all stainless steel but just so you know which watch this uh, this watch here is homaging so Pagani Design, if you're not familiar, obviously is a Chinese brand, comes from the AliExpress of the world. So you can find a lot of brands uh, that offer homage watches and Pagani Design is one of the most popular out there uh, on AliExpress. So definitely one that I recommend and there's a lot of other reviews by YouTubers out there and, and people that buy these, uh, these watches. So definitely recommend and i'll put the link in the description so you can buy the watch and you can decide what other uh, watches you'd like to to get they had they have different versions of this watch so they have the black and yellow and uh, also like a turquoise kind of color and they have this black and red which is one of my favorite ones i do have another homage to this model but the previous uh, version which was released in 2020 by Patek Philippe, which is the same Calatrava, uh, but it was uh, one that came also with the uh, canvas strap, so it wasn't nylon. So this one you can tell is nylon and leather on the back here. But uh, yeah, the Parnese is uh, another brand that made an homage to that watch and to the previous version because these uh, new versions that Patek released was last year, I think. So they released this new version of the Calatrava and they came in different uh, colors. Like I said, black and red, black and yellow. And I think they also have one that was black and teal. So it's really nice. Whereas the previous version, the first version that they released was uh, back in 2020 and it was just all uh, turquoise color. So. Anyways, before I get too deep into this uh, conversation about the watch, I just wanted to show you this is the box that you get with your Pagani Design watch. And there's other models that offer other options for boxes. You can get nice boxes that are a little bit bigger than this one. And you would have to pay a little bit more, but uh, it's definitely a lot ni nicer than this thing here. But this is for people that really don't care about having a, a box or a case with your watch. So you get the user's manual here, the international guarantee, it's all unsigned. You also get a guarantee card, also unsigned. And a little tag, as well as this nice little cloth. So going over the watch, the case size for this one is 40 millimeters with a case thickness of 12.5 12 mil, 12 millimeters. You have 100 meters water resistance with this watch and a screw in crown and sapphire crystal. You get loom on the indices there as well as on the hour and a minute hand. And it's just very well finished, well done homage with the brushing on the side of the case and polished on top of the bezel or on top of the lugs as well as all around the bezel so let me just give this a little, quick little clean and this is definitely one of the best watches i think Pagani design has made and of course they have uh, other ones that they have done really well like the Longines Spirit I think was also one of my favorite and I think one of the more higher quality watches that they they've done but this one is also really well done and you can see you get the signed 
Pagani Design logo there on the crown, screw in, and it's a good size crown also. And you got the hacking seconds. You got a legible date and just a really nice style. Uh, copied in the same style, of course, and design as the watch it's Spain homage to, which is a Patek Philippe Calatrava 6007G-010. Although the difference, I'd say, would be the, the numbers. So you don't have numbers on here. You just have these indices with the loom, whereas the Patek Philippe Calatrava has uh, numbers going all the way around. And if you turn around here, you can see the case back with the display of the movement, the Seiko NH35, which is typically the most popular movement across a lot of these micro brands and these Chinese watches that usually will have uh, reliable Japanese movement like the Seiko uh, NH35, which is very common on a lot of the automatic watches that this, uh, this brand uses, as well as other brands out there. And you can see there PD1778 right below the crown. Stain, all stainless steel, 100 meters water resistant. And you've got genuine leather straps with the nylon on the top part of the strap. Red stitches going all the way around. And it's just really good quality strap, I think. is. Uh, it's not something that Pagani Design does too much is, is leather straps or nylon straps. They usually just provide you the, the bracelets. Uh, bracelets are very common on the Pagani Design watches. But it also has this really nice buckle here with the Pagani Design logo. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you the loom. Just let me try to see if I can torch this up. My light my flashlight here does not have really good uh, lighting right now it's a little bit low on battery I think but let's see how much we can see of that loom and I paid about $80 or so after discounts and everything uh, for this watch so it's a really good price I got it um, for a really good price I think most automatic watches that Pagani Design has um, usually goes for a hundred dollars or more but for this one I got a really good price I think and you can start to see a little bit of that green loom so let me turn off the light and yeah it's decent looks like c3 loom so stronger around the indices than on the hands but uh, that's really all I have for you. I think I've kind of explained everything about this watch. 100 meters water resistance, sapphire crystal. You got the loom. You got this really beautiful dial with the guilloche pattern along the center part of the circle there on the dial. And got the minute markers there going along. Nice legible date, good size. Nice little date window there. Uh, with no frame, no metal frame or anything, just uh, just there by itself. And really cool seconds hand with the red combination there. So it's just a really cool watch overall, very sportsy. Uh, 100 meters water resistance, so you can definitely take this in the water and it won't be a problem. So a uh, great sports watch for a great price. I couldn't say... Uh, why you shouldn't buy this watch really. I think it's a great watch, even if it's an homage and you know, really looks almost exactly the same as the watch that it's homaging. I mean, it has the Pagani design name there, automatic. So you don't have to worry about people calling out as a fake because you can just proudly say it's a Pagani design and not a fake Patek Philippe. So, but that's a, another, conversation uh, to have I guess where people really get into it with the controversies of whether it's an homage or not uh, and what is allowed or what should be allowed and what shouldn't but it's not illegal so as far as I'm concerned this is fine and it's definitely a 
cool watch, so let me see here how it looks. I can show you how it looks on the wrist. And it's definitely a good size, 40 millimeters. It's a bit thick, but I think it doesn't stand out that much. Still looks decent there on the wrist. And it's a good size crown, not too big, not too small. And it has everything really I, I like in, in a watch. So it's casual, but also kind of, you could put a leather strap here that might make it look a little bit nicer and more, more formal. But due to the size, 40 millimeters is not that big, but I think it's still a size that most people would uh, maybe not consider, and especially with this thickness of 12.5 millimeters, most people would not consider this for a uh, dressy occasion, but you could definitely do it if you maybe change the strap, it might look a little bit more formal, uh, but definitely more of a sports watch. And that's all I have for you. So make sure to subscribe, like, share, the video with your friends uh, check out all the other videos i have my channel i also made a review of the same kind of watch uh, by another brand so the parnese as i mentioned they made a homage watch to the previous version of this this watch so parnese is another brand that you can find on aliexpress and they made a version of the 2020 Calatrava that Patek Philippe released, which is the previous version of this model here. But uh, yes, I think they have other colors available as well, black and yellow and black and teal or just teal uh, on uh, Pagani Design's uh, version of this watch. But I think also Bernie also has the uh, an homage to this watch and Bernie is also another brand you can find on AliExpress. They have, uh, I actually have their black and yellow, uh, exactly like this, but a little bit lighter, I would say. And I can maybe do a comparison video of all three watches, uh, of the same kind of, you know, homaging the same model, uh, later on. So I'll do that another day, but thanks for watching and I'll see you guys uh, next time. Take care.